Hey guys, my name is B. I travel full time in my SUV chariot and also my now tiny trailer cadence who's getting work done on. Meet Pup, Best Bear. We're sitting with him for a little while. We're over here making some dumplings and we are doing some recovery work on these. Look at this. We're doing some recovery work on my covers. So I figured that this would be a good little video to show y'all how I get that ready. I literally went to the Dollar Tree and picked up five of these. And I'm going to recover these corners. So this one I didn't do, but I'm going to cover that one. And I'm going to recover these to make them a little bit uh, thicker. Um, they're not falling apart at all. I did a really good job sealing them up but i need a little bit more space in the window seal if that makes sense like there's little gaps and stuff because they're not 100 percent perfect and i am looking into getting some um what you call these some of the ones that i have for my front and back which are the heat shield ones i'm looking at getting some of those but i'm not going to get them just yet because like i said they're kind of pricey and i have to get six of them so I think it came up to like $200 or something to get all six, which is not bad because they last forever, but um, I'm just gonna wait till I actually need them before I get it. But yeah, guys, we're just frying up some good old fashioned dumplings. Y'all, here I was doing it, chilling, listening to some music with the pup, finished one. I was like, darn, I didn't even show them, so. This is what it looked like before. And it's got the vinyl on there, which I wanted to put on both sides. I would, re if you ever make these, I would recommend doing them on both sides, but I just had enough vinyl to do it on one for all six sides. So I have this on this side, but basically I just put this rubber duct tape around it to put that extra seal on there. And also it adds almost like a quarter of an inch extra lip here. So when I tuck this into the window in the car, when I tuck it in this way, or if I decide to tuck it in that way, it'll be sealed up really nice. And if I have enough tape, I can just tape over this side. So it depends on how much tape I have left over. Cause I would like to tape this side up because I typically keep these little ones uh, in the back I have three different windows and I normally keep these in there. So you see this on the outside. So if I could duct tape this, it would be nice. And then I could just keep this on the outside and then do the duct tape on the inside. So we shall see if I have enough. I got five rolls, so let's see. But yep, that's what I'm about to do for this one. And then these right here, I just wanted to add some more inch around here. So if you can... These are like literally right to the edge, flipped over, like right over the corner. And I just want to add to this bottom part an extra inch. So a little bit more lip so that way I can push these up higher. Um, and then they'll cover up more space. And I don't think, yeah, see, everything's really held together really nicely. There's like no, there's this, but there's been no leakage or anything from it. So I really love these. They've been really heavy duty. And I normally keep this on the outside for stealth mode. And then if I'm out in BLM, I do it on this side to reflect the, the sun and to keep it nice and cool on the inside. So yeah, that's what I got for these four. But it does look like there's some like sticky. So I'm gonna see if I can, I have some Clorox wipes. So I might just like wipe that up. And that's literally just from the, the heat. You can see, like, it's just from the heat of it being so hot out there. Um, it's not on every part, but it's on some of them. So I'm going to check them and wipe them down while I'm here chilling. But that's what I'll be doing to these. So I'll show y'all what they look like when they're done. Um, yeah, it's going to pretty much look like that. And then I'm going to just install them into the truck so i can just have them tucked in there and they'll just be back in there like they normally were so yeah i'm gonna finish these up quick all right y'all so i was able to wipe everything down with these clorox wipes 
as much as I could and get all the extra tape glue from the corners of everything. It was really only on the vinyl side. So I did wipe that off of each one, but I did add a layer to the top and the bottom of each of the big ones. So now they look a little bit thicker and they will tuck in perfectly to the window with a thicker lip. So I'm really excited about that. And I'm about to go put in the smaller ones that I started with. Um, they're at the bottom of the pile here. But yeah, if you ever want some makeshift window covers, you can definitely make them with about 30 bucks. This installation, um, it's called, what was it called? Heat Tech or something like that. When, uh, yeah, I think it's called Heat Tech um, insulation. And then I just trimmed it out to the window size and I got some vinyl, trimmed that out to the window size. And then I just taped this duct tape from the Dollar Tree around the edges and then i've been using this for the last two years um so they started wearing a little bit so i did add an extra layer here but eventually i'll be getting all of the heat shield ones and then i won't have these anymore but for the time being these are now ready and re sealed like brand new wow buddy look at him freaking out Shh. so um they're all sealed pretty much brand new now. And I can tuck them back in. And then these right here, I did have enough tape and I have some left over to tape the inside. So I am gonna put these um, in the windows. I'm gonna put them, I'm gonna put these this on the outside and have this on the inside because the glue, I don't want the glue to stick to the window at all. So that's how I'm gonna have those in and I'm excited to see how those look. Um, so yeah, I'm about to go put those in the car now. This has been a pretty short video, but I'm just kind of getting ready to go to my next spot. Um, so I'm doing laundry, I'm about to finish up a couple other vlog edits and stuff and get ready for the work week. So this is kind of just a short video of some stuff that I'm doing in the meantime to prep for the road in november so for now this is what i got i'm about to go put these in thank y'all for tuning in please like share subscribe leave a comment and i will see y'all in the next video peace